Good morning, Don Lane, Fraser Valley News, your morning news update for this Sunday, February the 20th. The Olympics are now over, NASCAR cranks up with the Daytona 500, and uh, while we are going to have some showers and it's going to start feeling a little cooler for the next few days, uh, right now we are looking at 25 to 30 centimeters of snow again for another day on the Coquihalla as well as the Hope Princeton. So yes, it is the long weekend, but if you're thinking of traveling in the interior, uh, again, take her easy. If you can hold off until tomorrow, even better. Uh, you may have to stall those plans because again, uh, Coquihalla and uh, the Hope Princeton are going to be slow. Tip of the hat to a couple of Eastern Fraser Valley basketball champions. The grade nine girls from GW Graham, the grade eight boys from Mount Celesi. They won their titles. Congrats, you guys! We've got your uh, congrats. We've got your uh, uh, formal formal pictures up on FEN Fraser Valley News Network dot com. Chilliwack Flight Fest has a major meeting coming up, which is open to the public for volunteers on March the first. They are fairly certain if they can pull this thing off because restrictions are falling. Um, they're hopeful that there will be a flight fest in Chilliwack uh, for the summer. So we'll be following that story as well. Uh, of course, there were a lot of Freedom Convoy rallies across the country. The one at the uh, border crossing on 176th. And uh, media uh, definitely harassed. It's all up on video. RCMP are now contemplating charges. Uh, they are reviewing video that was taken by, uh, that was not only posted to Facebook, but also taken by media outlets like CBC and Global themselves. We'll be following that story as well. If there's something we should know about, as always, FEN at Shaw.ca. FEN at Shaw.ca. Enjoy the day, just bundle up for it. Don Lane, Fraser Valley News.